Hello everyone, my friends call me Boz. Today we're going to talk about camera stuff. That's my, uh, my thing, been doing camera stuff for 40 years, showing my age. So today we're going to talk about Bronica camera stuff, medium format camera stuff, and self timers. As you know, these medium formats, lots of them don't have a self timer on it. Uh, this one here, Bronica SQ. I uh, bought this new years ago, as you can see, it's still in beautiful condition, superb camera. So this camera, like the Hasselblads, don't have a self timer. It has a little shutter cable release connection here, and uh, that's all it's got. So how do we get around that? Well, there's a couple of ways. Uh, one is you can use one of those um, rolled up tubes. It's a, it's a pneumatic cable release. Now the other thing you can do is uh, use a cable release. Well, unless you can get a 25 foot cable release, this one here is about a foot and a half. Uh, these are good for tripod mount stuff. As you can see, it's got a little plunger here, little point pumps out here when you push the other end in. That actuates the uh, the shutter release. So what else can you do? Well, there's another way. Mechanical timers. I don't know if they still make these things, but you can get mechanical timers like this. Now, let me zoom in so you can see what I'm talking about. So here's this mechanical timer. I had to move the camera much closer. So this particular one, made in Japan, came with an adapter like this. Now, this screws on some cameras. You've seen them where they have a threaded connection on top of the cameras. You can do that. And the button goes inside and the plunger pumps out to, uh, to actuate. So, there's a little on-off actuator here and this is the clockwork mechanism. So to operate it, you turn it like that and then that's the release and you can see how that works. So here it is, the Bronica is already, it's uh, laid on its side for demonstration purposes. The shutter is already cocked so I'm going to hit the start lever I'll time this at the same time, and you should hear it clunk when, uh, when it releases. So here goes. You heard that solid clunk? That was approximately 10 seconds of delay. So it works perfectly. The mechanical self-timer, made in Japan, clockwork mechanism, very small. Here's my finger next to it, so you can get an idea of the size of it. Very light, very small, well made, chrome plated, 10 second delay, fits on many older cameras including the Hasselblad and the Bronica. If you like the video, click yes, and if you don't like it, don't bother clicking anything.